Hello, this is Dr. Chad Lavender from Orthopedic Research of Virginia, and in this video, we will present arthroscopic techniques in the use of biocartilage from Arthrex in the patellofemoral joint of the knee. The first case is an isolated patellar lesion with no maltracking. And as you can see, we debride the remaining cartilage off of the bone to create a clean surface of bone with nice stable edges. Depending on whether the lesion is medial or lateral, it is useful to make an accessory portal in the patellofemoral joint to aid in preparing the lesion and delivering the biocartilage. After you have smooth, stable edges and a clean base, you can now perform a microfracture, which may be performed in a variety of ways. Here we use a small K-wire, and you could also use the Arthrex power pick. These are favored over the standard awl technique based on the characteristics of the vent produced. It can be helpful to have an assistant use their thumb on the opposite side of the patella to perform counter pressure. Next, turn off the water and apply the biocartilage. The bone should be as dry as possible and it may be helpful to open your trocar to air which will vent the joint. You can also use epi-soaked mini sponges to help with any remaining moisture. The biocartilage should be evenly distributed with no ridges. To help with evenly distributing the biocartilage, you may use metal spatulas. Finally, the fibrin is added over the biocartilage. The fibrin should also be evenly distributed. And as you can see, the fibrin has a nice viscosity that sticks to the underlying biocartilage, even regardless of gravity. The second case is a trochlear defect without any maltracking. You can see to help get a nice stable edge of cartilage, here we used a suction punch. After this, we used an arthroscopic curette which removed the excess cartilage on the lesion. It is helpful to have different angles of curettes available to you. You will also see in the video it is helpful to switch portals to help with your caretting of the lesion. Similar to the first case, we used a small K-wire to perform the microfracture. Again, we like the flexibility of using either the K-wire or the Arthrex power pick. Here you can see a metal spatula which was mentioned earlier. 
that is used to help smooth out the bio cartilage to a nice even distribution. After this, the fibrin is placed over the bio cartilage in similar fashion to before. And finally, you can see the finished product of the bio cartilage placement in the trochlea lesion.